Mudalal Vora born the 20th of December 1928 is an Indian politician belonging to the Indian National Congress Inc He is the former chief minister of Madhya Pradesh 1985 to 1988 1989 Topic Early life Mudalal Vora was born on 20 December 1928 at Nimbi Joda in Jodhpur state of British India's Rajputana Agency present-day Nagore district, Rajasthan. His parents were Mohanlal Vora and Amba Bai. His forefathers came from Nimbi Joda, and prior to that from Falaudi. He received his education at Raipur and Kolkata. He had also worked with several newspapers for many years. He married Shanti Devi Vora. The couple have four daughters and two sons. State politics In 1968, Vora became a member of the Municipal Committee of Durg then part of Madhya Pradesh. He was elected to the Legislative Assembly of Madhya Pradesh in 1972. He was elected to Vidhan Sabha again in 1977 and 1980. He was appointed as a Minister of State in Arjun Singh's cabinet, and was in charge of the Higher Education Department. He was elevated to the cabinet minister in 1983. He also served as the deputy chairman of Madhya Pradesh State Road Transport Corporation during 1981 84. On 13 March 1985, Vora was appointed chief minister of Madhya Pradesh. He resigned from the post of chief minister on 13 February 1988 to join the union government. National politics On 14 February 1988, Vora became a member of the Rajya Sabha, and assumed the office of Union Minister of Health, Family Welfare and Civil Aviation. He was a cabinet minister in Government of India. He was appointed as Governor of Uttar Pradesh on May 16, 1993 and held office till May 3, 1996. Mudalal Vora was in 1998-99 member of the 12th Lok Sabha. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Role in the Indian National Congress. Mudalal Vora is very close to High Command of Inc. and has supported nomination of Rahul Gandhi as the party's prime ministerial candidate. In the 1980s, he served as the president of the Madhya Pradesh Congress Committee, the party's state unit. Vora holds important positions in all the three entities involved in the National Herald case, the Associated Journals Limited AJL, the Young Indian and the All India Congress Committee AICC. He became the chairman and managing director of AJL on the 22nd of March 2002. He has also served as the AICC treasurer since before that. In addition, he has been a 12% shareholder and a director of Young Indian. 